It is looking pretty good. We're going to have the best of both worlds, having some rain, but also having some dry weather as well. It's just going to depend on which day. Now let's get a look at our forecast for Wednesday before we get to this weekend. We're starting off with some clouds out there. Very cloudy overcast skies along with a few showers passing on through. And this is pretty much how the entire day is going to look, keeping things cloudy with just a few light showers. But to start off this morning in Corvallis, we're looking at mild conditions, 46 degrees. Remember the average low this time of year is actually 35 degrees so starting nearly or over 10 degrees above average now down in Roseburg also starting off with those mild conditions temperatews a bit cooler though 44 degrees there dew point at 42 degrees of visibility at 10 miles so that means we do not have the fog this morning which is great news for those of you who are sick of the fog colder air out to Central Oregon 31 in Odell Lake 30 in the pine Bend starting off at 28 degrees but mild conditions all along I-5 and out to the coast in the mid 40s. So we're getting a head start to our low temperature and that means we're looking at some warm temperatures as we head into the afternoon as we begin to climb and look at that warmer air push on through. Now big picture across the state what we have going on well we're looking at overcast skies not only here in the western portion of the state but also out to central and eastern Oregon but you can see see there are a few breaks in the clouds however there is some reinforcement just back off to the north and west this area of clouds is beginning to push on through and bringing a few light showers with it so we're going to see that move through the area late this morning into the early afternoon so still keeping things pretty cloudy out there and also a bit wet now we do have high pressure in control of our weather but we're looking at some waves riding over it. There's that high pressure centered a bit further down to the south and west, but you can see the clouds moving over that high pressure ridge and moving into our area, bringing those showers with it. So as we head into the next couple of days or so, high pressure will mainly be in control. So we're not looking at a major storm system to swing on through, bringing us some very cold temperatures or bringing us some very heavy rains. We're just looking at those weak waves to move through, increasing our clouds and bringing a few light showers. But as we head into Friday we're looking at that high pressure to move closer into our area and that means we're looking at some warm temperatures especially along the coast some places could get near 60 degrees so playing through though the next couple of hours before we get to Friday we still have to make it through today and tomorrow we're looking at overcast guys out there with just a few light showers as we head throughout the day we'll still keep the clouds and that shower chance through tonight into tomorrow morning it's not until we get to tomorrow afternoon when we'll finally begin to see those clouds break apart those showers move out and dry weather moves on in and that's going to last through about Friday so along the coast though back to today we're looking at those isolated showers temperatures in the low 50s by the afternoon we dry things out Thursday afternoon and look at that on Friday mostly sunny high temperatures into the upper 50s and even near 60 but by Saturday we're looking at some showers to move right back on in and also bringing us some cooler air on um, basin today mid 50s looking at mostly cloudy skies just a slight chance for a shower heading into Thursday and Friday still keeping those clouds but highs climbing into the 50s rain moves in on Saturday cascades freezing about 4500 feet just a slight chance for a rain or snow shower above 4500 feet central Oregon mostly cloudy today highs climbing into the low 50s but by Friday looking at mostly sunny skies as well high temperatures near 50 degrees for the valley isolated showers today high temperatures will also climb into the low 50s we dry things out Thursday afternoon into Friday but Friday we're going to be stuck in the fog that's going to keep our highs in the low 50s but we cool things down as we head into the weekend and rain moves in on Saturday.